Good evening, everybody, and welcome. We're underway here at Manning Field with interleague boys soccer. St. Mary's, a big one for St. Mary's. A win today would officially put them in the state tournament. Take on Lincoln Sudbury, who is very good. Both teams looking for their ninth win. Lincoln Sudbury is 8-1. and one. St. Mary's is 8-1-1. One, and one. They only play 19 games, so they need 19 points. And a win today would give them 19. Connor Latchman is in net for Lincoln Sudbury. Nicholas Pappas for the Spartans. And as usual, I have to get used to, the home team wears the dark uniform. St. Mary's wearing the blue. Lincoln Sudbury wearing the white. The Oliveira broken up. They knock it to the middle. They knock it deep, looking for a break down the far side. Trying to walk around, looking for a shot. Pappas had to make the save. That's a nice job by Nick Casper. He chased it down, stopped a little pivot. Good hard shot. Pappas drills it deep, well past midfield. The place has just now cleared out. We had a huge crowd here for English and Swampscott football. And English came up with a huge win. Swampscott was undefeated. They throw it out in front. Lincoln Sudbury heads it away. St. Mary's trying to keep it alive. It got deflected off a body. That was... Conley trying to throw it back to the middle and finally winds up going out of play. Lastman will kick it away. A huge win for Chris Carroll against Swampscott. Swampscott was undefeated. Dead even at halftime. A big second half by the Bulldogs, offensively and defensively. Lincoln Sudbury broken up, tipped away. St. Mary's gets it back. They knock it deep, trying to send George down the near side. Lincoln Sudbury gets there first and takes it away. And now we got, and now George is gonna get a yellow card. I think the official might have said something to George before. The ball was going out of bounds a minute or two ago. And he kind of bumped or shoved the Lincoln Sudbury player who was trying to let it go out of bounds. I think he said something to him. And now when George comes and knocks down perfectly, not intentionally, he just slid with his foot to try and get the ball. But he took out the pins of the Lincoln Sudbury player and... So they flashed up the yellow card. You don't want to be getting too many of those. Headed away by Nolan Perez. De Oliveira with it. Knocking it clear across field. St. Mary's takes it back to the middle. Faking, trying to get the pass off. Couldn't get a really good shot off. They got their foot on it and just kind of tipped it wide and out of play. I think that was Niccolo. And Lashman will kick it away. Off a head, off another head. Lincoln Sudbury trying to control. Trying to get down that far side, and it was Nolan Perez, I believe, that knocked it out of play. And Mary's takes it away. Coming up that far side. 
bounce over the foot as they try to get in the middle. And somebody knocks it deep. Hustling over is O'Brien to kick it away. This is a very good test for both teams. They're both very good. Coming down the near side, trying to walk in. Walking in, they tip it, and it went right through the wickets. They try to slide it across to get a better shot, and it went right through the wickets of the would-be pass receiver. And it gets knocked out. Tim Marys with the throw in. Tipped ahead. Lincoln Sudbury collects. And they knock it deep back in the St. Mary's end. Mackey goes and gets it and kicks it out of play. Trying to center it, and it wound up on top of the net. Didn't miss by much by going out in front. Pampas went high to get it. Then he had a few palpitations when it went over his head, but then he breathed a sigh of relief when it landed on top of the net, and Mackey will kick it away. Mike D'Agostino, the head guy for the Spartans. David Hosford. Well, Lincoln Sudbury, usually one of the best. They faced St. Mary's in the tournament a few times. All these teams know each other. Gets deflected to George, knocking it deep. Knocked away. And they blew the whistle for some reason. I, don't, I didn't see it hit anybody in the hand. I thought he you know, got a head on. He might have missed it with his head, and I didn't see it and got it with his arm. Well, they're going to give St. Mary's a free kick, so Mackey will take it. Line drives it, headed away by Lincoln Sudbury. And Lincoln Sudbury goes down. Uh, without a call. And I guess they did call it because they're going to give Lincoln Sudbury a free kick. They kept playing a little bit, so I th thought they didn't blow the whistle. By everybody. Lincoln Sudbury kicks it to the net. They're there. It's loose. Perez kicks it away. Pappas was out of the net thinking he was going to get it. He couldn't get it. There was a Lincoln Sudbury player there, but he couldn't get to it. He got squashed by a couple of defenders, and then Perez kicked it away. Pappas kicks it high and deep past midfield. Makes a big bounce. Lincoln Sudbury knocks it to the far side and then knocks it deep. Coming in, take the shot, they get under it, knocked it way up over everything. Lincoln Sudbury with a couple of opportunities. That again was Nick Casper with an opportunity. And here he's down the far side, George. Trying to throw it in front. Lincoln Sudbury blocks it easily and gets it upfield. 
O'Brien hustles and steps in front of the pass, and Lincoln Sudbury knocked it out. It went off McKinnon. They knock it loose. Niccolo look with it, trying to get the shot off. He knocked it off McKinnon. St. Mary's will get a corner kick. They boot it deep. The Mary's try to punch it back in front. Lincoln Sudbury knocks it away. And it goes out off the Spartans. That was Casper again, way out in front, looking for that long pass. They knock it clear across field. From one side to the other. Now they knock it to the net. Pappas came out and tried to make the catch and misplayed it. And it's going to go out, and that's going to give Lincoln Sudbury a corner kick. It went off Pappas. He went to go get it. Went off his hand. Luckily for St. Mary's, it deflected away from the net over in the corner. Lincoln Sudbury will get a free kick. It gets blocked. Pappas knocks it away. Lincoln Sudbury trying to keep it alive. And St. Mary's will knock it deep. That was Conley, I think, knocking it away. It was loose again. Lincoln Sudbury all around the St. Mary's net. Knocked out by Lincoln Sudbury. McKinnon with it. Blocked by Thong Stephong. In the middle, Lincoln Sudbury dropping it back. Nice passing, gets them down close. They get it to the near side. Broken up. St. Mary's breaks it up, takes it away. And Conley knocks it deep. Thong's the phone, collecting. Down the far side, stop shot, trying to throw it in front, blocked. Jaws looking to get it. Winds up with it, and it gets knocked out by Lincoln Sudbury. St. Mary's will get the throw in down deep. O'Brien, one of the three on the back line, comes all the way down for the throw-in. Loose out in front. Lincoln Sudbury knocks it away. Mackey keeps it in and knocks it out. Lincoln Sudbury will make a few changes. A rare Saturday afternoon soccer game. Tip taken away by St. Mary's. Lincoln Sudbury takes it back. A couple of nice shifts. They knock it deep. St. Mary's picked it off. Mackey got blocked. Gets it back. Lincoln Sudbury takes it away. Nice little shift trying to walk in. They take the shot. It goes wide to the near side. Lincoln Sudbury will track it down and keep it in. Can't get a shot off. 
Pollock the Fallen knocked it away. Winds up back in the Lincoln Sudbury end over to McKinnon. And they're going to call Conley. Taking down Coletti. McKinnon will take the free kick. Nolan Perez kicked it away. McKinnon tried to keep it alive, knocked it out of play. St. Mary's will make a couple changes. Off the head of Nguyen. All the way back. They'll leave it. For Lachman who kicks it deep. St. Mary's got a head on it. Lincoln Sudbury. Trying to knock it upfield. It got blocked. Nolan Perez back checking. Knocked it away. To the far side. And he threw it over the net. Again, Pappas came way out of the net over to the far side looking for the ball. Couldn't get it from a tough angle. Lincoln Sudbury had a shot but missed the net again. St. Mary's really hasn't come close to Lashman. It's been all Lincoln Sudbury so far. We have a nice little crowd for this one. He keeps it alive. And they try to clear it upfield. They knocked it off Nguyen. To flex all the way back almost to the St. Mary's bench here and it winds up going out of play off Lincoln Sudbury. Down that far side. Pass too far. Lincoln Sudbury will let it go out of play. Lashman kicks it Upfield, Mark Crane blocked by George, tipped away by George. Lincoln Sudbury hustles. George was slipping and went down and went off George out of play. Headed away. LeBron over there with it. Halfway through and counting this first half. And we're right back where we started. Dead even. St. Mary's nothing. Lincoln Sudbury nothing. St. Mary's going to get a corner kick. As we just passed the halfway mark of this first half. No score. Interleague. You'll, these two teams will both be threats in the tournament. It gets right in the middle. 
Last one went up and got a hand on it and knocked it away. St. Mary's will get another corner kick. This one coming from the near side. They put that right dead center of the net out in front. And Lashman just went up in a crowd and got a hand on it, slapped it away. Now St. Mary's got a head on it, but tipped it the wrong way, away from the net. Lincoln Sudbury knocks it very deep. Mackey has to hustle back and get it. And he knocks it into the Lincoln Sudbury bench area out of play. So St. Mary's looking for a, a trifecta. The girls' soccer team won yesterday. The boys' football team, they just told me, won this afternoon. So they could make it three for three if they could beat Lincoln Sudbury. And, of course, I mentioned up front, big game for St. Mary's because if they win, they're officially in the state tournament. They knock it deep, looking for a break. St. Mary's there, they overran it. Perez with it. Tips it back. Hit it near side. Kevin Perez had it knocked away from him. Nolan Perez will take the throw in. Now he won't take the throw in. O'Brien will take the throw in. And it's not a throw in, it's a free kick. So they made contact with Kevin Perez. O'Brien gets it out in front. They get a head on it. Nolan Perez was there. Kevin Perez was there. One of the Perez family got a head on it, tipped it, but Latchman was able to make the save. They try to knock it back to Mackey. They knocked it by him. Lincoln Sudbury takes it away. They try to skip it off Mackey. He took it away. And now they're going to, when they try to knock it upfield, they knocked it right into the face. And he put his hand up to block it going to his face, the, the Lincoln Sudbury player. And that caused the touch. And that gives St. Mary's the free kick. O'Brien will take it. Yeah, Lincoln Sudbury content to just kick it very deep. LeBron heads it away. Nolan Perez knocks it into the St. Mary's bench area. Lincoln Sudbury will make changes. Now it gets knocked out by Lincoln Sudbury. Lincoln Sudbury has the better of the chances. They've been all around the St. Mary's net. Happens had to make one or two saves. A couple of others they knocked over the net out of play. St. Mary's had that one header by, I think it was Kevin Perez. Lashman made the save on it. It wasn't a difficult save, but he did get a head on it, did get it to the net. And we're going to get contact called against Lincoln Sudbury. And St. Mary's will get a free kick from the 45. They put it very quickly in play. George drops it back. Nolan Perez. And then Lincoln Sudbury steps in and knocks it out. They get it to the net, but Lashman is there to almost waist high. Squeezed it, stepped up, and he'll kick it away. High, booming kick, way past midfield. We well, like to see. Somebody punt the ball like that. <laughs> we 
Quick and Sudbury again moving the ball very well. St. Mary's takes it away, pops it up. Quick and Sudbury winds up with it. They knock it deep. Are they going to get there? Yeah, they kept it alive. Uh, but then O'Brien comes over and knocks it away. St. Mary's knocks it deep. And it gets knocked out by Lincoln Sudbury. They try to send the Oliveira up the near side. Thongs the fall got taken down. John Reese got a piece of him. St. Mary's will get another free kick. De Oliveira takes it out in front. I think it was Lincoln Sudbury got a head on it, knocked it away. And then Lashman came running over at the side of the net, grabbed it, he'll kick it away. And again, another booming high kick pa past midfield. De Oliveira heads it back the other way. Lincoln Sudbury will let it go out of play. Well, Again, multi-substitutions for Lincoln Sudbury. They want to keep everybody fresh, I guess. Perez, the thong Stefan. Gets by, they leave it for him. McKinnon took it away, slipped it back to the goaltender, and now Lashman is going to throw it upfield. And Lincoln Sudbury is back at it. Pappas just stepped in front and got two hands on it and knocked it away. They threw it to the net. It looked like they might have a chance to tip it home. I think that was Casper. And just as he went up to get ahead on it, Pappas stepped in front, got two hands on it, and slapped it away. Kevin Perez. Gets it back, knocks it deep, looking for a break. A little bit behind the intended receiver. And St. Mary's can't save it, it went out of play. Long pass, I think it was intended for Niccolo. And it was just a little bit behind him. St. Mary's collects. Lincoln Sudbury takes it away and moves it to the middle. McKinnon on the near side. Broken up. Once the phone took it away. Trying to walk in. Walks in and knocks it home. He knocked it off the goaltender. It went, looked like it was might have missed. It touched the far post and deflected in. Nice bid by Thong Stefong. They almost took it away from him. He got it back. He used, he screened the defender off well. Walked in from a right angle, a little bit of an angle. Knocked it to the net. Lashman just got a piece of it. Looked like it might have gone just wide, but it hit the far post. And the lucky bounce for St. Mary's, it deflected in. So St. Mary's, virtually their first shot on net. Uh, they did have that deflection, the header. Uh, but their first good scoring opportunity Hong Stefong knocks it home and St. Mary's grabs a 1-0 lead.
shot got blocked. Pappas will come out and grab it. Casper again was going to the net, but that shot got blocked and it went behind him. He couldn't get a piece of it to try and deflect it. And Pappas drills this one almost to the 20-yard line. He boomed that kick. Mackey knocks it away. Walking right in. And walking right in. He finally lost it. Ignacio Ortiz shifting, sliding, baking. Just as he got by the last defender, it looked like he might walk in. Last one makes the save. I think that's Conley with the shot off the nice pass from George. But just as Ortiz made that last little move, Pappas was able to squeeze the ball and hold on and not give him the shot on that. But that was a great move. Did everything but put it in the net. Cut by everybody. Pappas just stoned him because the ball came a little bit too far off his foot. And they almost walked in again. Now they're going to call St. Mary's for running over. And they're going to talk to the St. Mary's player as well. I think that was Thongstafong. He went by, pushed it by, and he pushed it a little too far. Actually, it was the Oliveira. Pushed a little too far, went to go get it. He was going to give it up. Now I look at it again. It was Kevin Perez that ran over. This is Nolan Perez trying to walk in. Tipping it ahead. George, a little behind the back, trying to give it back. It got blocked. Nolan Perez and George trying to combine. Lincoln Sudbury trying to walk in. They slide it across. They line up the shot. Pappas made the save. That's Casper again. They had to come over to the middle. And then the pass got thrown across. Casper, good hard shot. Pappas was able to make the save. That's the second or third time on Casper. They're going to get Casper for manhandling George at the 35-yard line. Mackey will take the kick from the 35 as we get seven minutes and counting left in the first half. one nothing St. Mary's. But Lincoln Sudbury has been all over the St. Mary's net. They've done everything but put it in. A lot of chances. Haven't been able to get it by Pappas yet. Walking in, they try to center it. Blocked by George and O'Brien. They knock it deep. Nolan Perez hustling. Lincoln Sudbury lost it out of bounds. Matthew Ward. A little strange the setup for Lincoln Sudbury. All juniors and seniors. No sophomores, no freshmen. You usually don't see that. Throw and skip pass that was going to go out. Lincoln Sudbury had a kick it away. They were looking to let it go, but it bounced off a foot. And if they let it go, it would have been a corner kick. So they booted away and booted out of play. 
And they're going to give him a corner kick anyway. They, they called it out before he knocked it out of bounds. They called it out off the back line. So the corner kick coming from the near side. Jaws just missed a header. Back to the near side. Trying to throw it again in. Samir's got a head on it, but deflected it away. Samir's kept it in, and they still keep it in. It goes out now off Nguyen. Going to call George for climbing the back, trying to get that header. He was all over Lucy. Knocked away. Somebody keeps it in. They get a foot on it, and they knocked it wide left and out of play. That was Crane knocking it out. Headed upfield by St. Mary's. George knocks it to the near side. Nguyen couldn't keep it in. Throwing coming from right in front of the St. Mary's bench. Headed out by Nguyen. Now they knock it all the way back to midfield. They kick it across. McKinnon pushes it upfield. Trying to walk around, trying to walk in. Shot, Pappas held the post. Another nice bid by Ortiz. Went around. Tough angle. Pappas was able to hold the post on the near side. He had no, no place to shoot it except right to Pappas. It went out. Lincoln somebody will get a corner kick. It goes deep. They got a head on it. They knocked it over the net. They knocked it. The free kick, corner kick, past the net. And they went up and got a head on it and knocked it over the net. That was Matthew Ward getting a header. And now Lincoln Survey's going to get called for going up over Niccolo. Matthew will take the kick. Headed away by Lincoln Sudbury, and it's going to go out of play. Two minutes and counting left in this first half. one nothing St. Mary's deflected away, popped up. St. Mary's collects. Lincoln Sudbury knocked it out. And we'll get a substitution before they throw it in. Knocked out again by Lincoln Sudbury. Nolan Perez tips it ahead. Lincoln Sudbury takes it away. And then they lost it out of bounds. And they knock it out again. He tried to tip it to Jaws. Lincoln Sudbury picked it off. 
Time winding down here in this first half. Nice little shift taking it to the middle, trying to walk in. Shift again. And he's still with it. Big time save by Pappas. That's a great play by Matthew Ward. He went coast to coast. They tipped it once. He got it back. He made a couple of shifts. He got a good hot shot. It was going in the far post. That would have been a backbreak of a St. Mary's to give up in the closing seconds. We can start, as we mentioned before, has done everything but put the ball in the net. They've been all around. Pappas had to make a couple of big time saves. A couple of times they were wide open and missed the net. And St. Mary's drives that high and wide and over everything and out of play. And as they do that, they blow the whistle, and that's going to end the first half. So a nice rush by Joseph Thongstefong down the right side, tipped it off the goaltender, snuck inside the far post, off the post, and that's the difference. It's St. Mary's 1, Lincoln Sudbury nothing at halftime. Welcome back as we're set to start the second half here at Manning Field. Uh, Joseph Thongs to Thongs goal, the difference in the game. one nothing St. Mary's. And we mentioned before, a win would officially put them in the state tournament with several games left to play. They could certainly be looking for a top seeding so they could get at least one or two home games. Pappas and Nett made a couple of very nice saves. I know he stoned Nick Casper a couple of times. He's got Casper talking to himself as the ball goes out of bounds. Out off Lincoln Sunbury. And Lincoln Subby knocks it out again. St. Mary's trying to bang it to the net. It got blocked. They get it back. Again, trying to knock it towards the net. Blocked again. It goes out. St. Mary's will get the throw in down deep. Headed away. St. Mary's collects. They knock it back. And again, they try to knock it to the middle. It got deflected. They swung and missed on an attempted shot from dead center. And now Lincoln Sudbury battling. De Oliveira battling. Everybody, all hands on deck. And I mean hands. They had hands all. They were pushing, whacking. They let them play a little bit there. O'Brien knocks it downfield. And knock deep. Mackey knocked it away. Shot from long range, got blocked by Nolan Perez. Came from nowhere to block that one. He was behind the play. All, all of a sudden from the side. And now Mackey. Runs headlong into Joseph Mepham. Thong Stephon battling with three or four white shirts. They finally blow the whistle as he got knocked down. De Oliveira takes the kick and they bring it back and do it over again. They knock it deep, try to get it to the net, head it away. Latchman came way out of the net. Now another shot deflected by Latchman, trying to save it. He couldn't, it went out. 
St. Mary's will get a corner kick. He went to his left, made the save, slapped it away, and then almost crawling to the back line trying to save it from going out. And that's not going to make it. It's going to hook behind the net and out of play. And Lashman will kick it away. Gets it out just about the midfield. Nolan Perez looking for it. Slips past Lincoln Sudbury. Tips it back. St. Mary's picks off the pass and knocks it deep. And it wound up going out off Lincoln Sudbury, I think. He was trying to keep George away from it. The coaching staff at St. Mary's is saying it went off. Said he touched it. Officials didn't see it. So they gave it to Lincoln Sudbury and now St. Mary's knocks it out again. McKinnon will throw it in. By everybody. I think that's O'Brien knocking it away and out of play. I guess everybody takes it away. And St. Mary slides and knocks it out. Lincoln Sudbury will get a corner kick coming from the far side. Out in front, they got what they wanted. They got a head on it, and they knocked it over the net. They've done that a few times. Yeah, at least four or five that they've knocked over the net. We can suddenly keep beginning the St. Mary's end down that far side. Broken up nicely. And they bang it off Lincoln Sudbury. Pops straight up in the air. Lincoln Sudbury heads it away. They missed the header. It went back to LeBron. Tipped. Nolan Perez looking for it. Lincoln Sudbury looking for it. They get it. They'll get the throw in. And we've got a player way back upfield in front of, way behind the play in front of the St. Mary's bench area that's down. I didn't get the young man's number, but he was kind of Hopping off, looked like an ankle, foot. Let's hope he's going to be all right. Pass behind the antenna receiver. Down the near side with a rush. That's Kevin Nguyen. And it gets knocked out by Machuca. And they're calling it a corner kick, so it'll come from the near side for St. Mary's. And it was, looked like it might go to the goaltender before that. Lincoln somebody got a foot on it and kicked it away. Mm -hmm. 
Ripham's kind of mad at himself. He tried to hold on to it, get around, and he made a nice little shift, but when he did, he lost it out of bounds. Hunks the phone, knocks it deep. Trying to throw it in front. It skipped in front, and the shot got blocked by McKinnon. They lined up the shot and drilled it. And McKinnon stepped in front and bailed out the goaltender. He made the save. And now that ball bounced up and Conley got a hand on it. And that'll give Lincoln Sudbury the free kick. So a big opportunity for the Spartans. And the defense took it away. Nice deflection. Not only deflected away, but took it away and starts it back the other way. De Oliveira. Cuts back to the middle. And trying to throw it across to George, and he threw it behind them. It's going to go out of play, and Lincoln Sudbury will get the throw in. Lincoln Sudbury will make substitutions. That would have been a very pretty goal for St. Mary's. It would have given them a little bit of insurance. A little bit of breathing room. Instead, McKinnon, the defender, turned goaltender and made the save. To the near side. Couldn't get around. Lincoln Sudbury coming back. Broken up by St. Mary's nicely. And he pushed it a little too far. Lincoln Sudbury had it. Now St. Mary's takes it back. De Oliveira. Still in control. All the way down. Finally gets knocked out by Benjamin Ryan. St. Mary's will make a substitution. And it's going to be a corner kick for St. Mary's coming from the near side. They tip it back looking for the shot. It got deflected. They got what they wanted, but nice defense. Ryan, with that nice defensive play, blocked the shot. St. Mary's will get the throw in. Knocked out. St. Mary's will get a corner kick. They hurry it up. They get it in quickly. De Oliveira knocking it to the net. They knock it away. Perez had a shot, got under it, tipped it over the net. They went very quickly. De Oliveira fired it. Lincoln Sudbury knocked it away, but right to Perez, who had a shot. But it was, wasn't was on the turf. It was bouncing a little bit, maybe up, not quite knee high. He got under it, tipped it over the net. Good scoring opportunity goes by the boards. Now the line drive past midfield. Lincoln Sudbury on the fly. Blocked by St. Mary's. Lincoln Sudbury gets it back. Blocked by St. Mary's again. Nolan Perez with a couple of shifts. Knocks it upfield and they knocked the St. Mary's player down.
Hi, Hop. George trying to keep it alive. Nguyen trying to keep it alive. They finally knock it away. Thong Safong with a couple of nice shifts takes the shot. Lashman will make the save. Got a good look at that one, able to make the save off shot from long range. And last one will come all the way out, making sure George doesn't get there. And kicks it out of sight. He bounced up in the seats and actually came back. The throw in's going to go out of play. You kind of knew what way these two teams, their, their history, the way they're playing, and the year they're having, that this was going to be a knockdown, dragged out war. And it's turned out to be just that. They knock it deep. Pappas will come out, make sure nobody gets there first, and he'll kick it away. Lincoln Sudbury coming back, popping it deep, headed away by O'Brien. Bodies go down, no call on that. They knock it deep, looking for George. Lincoln Sudbury knocks it out. We'll have substitutions for both teams. And somebody's going to get called for leaning on and hanging on. And St. Mary's will get a free kick. They were trying to get around and couldn't. Couldn't get close to the ball. They kick it to the net. The header goes to the near side. Nolan Perez will keep it in play. And he tried to get around and throw it out in front. And with the left foot, he knocked it behind the net and out of play. And we'll have substitutions for both teams. Lanceman will kick it away. Off the head of Nolan Perez. St. Mary's gets there and takes it away, but they're going to get called for holding and pulling away. They grabbed the defender and pulled him back so they could get around him and go get the ball. Lashman will kick it away. He booms another one. Looking like he was trying to put that one in the net. Nguyen kicks it upfield, headed away. St. Mary's collecting. They throw it deep to the near side. Getting there first was Majuka, knocking it away and out of play. Nolan Perez will take the throw in after we have a substitution for the Spartans. Knocked out again. Loose out in front, trying to get a hold of it. Lashman tried to grab it. He couldn't. It deflected off him and deflected away. A big break for Lincoln Sudbury. Good hustle by Mackey there, getting the ball first. Conley going for the ball. He wound up bumping in.
to Ryan. St. Mary's knocking it away. Lincoln Sudbury to the near side, looking to get a shot. And he finally gets a shot from long range. And it's going to go wide right corner or. I don't know if he's in relation to Bobby or. Kicked it wide right and out of play. They deflected off one of their own players. And now Conley just ran into. He was going for the ball. And he just slammed in. Tally Desmaris got the brunt of that. And Conley's a big boy. They're waiting for, I think, Connor Mackey to tie his shoe. Uh, yeah, Kick coming from just inside the 50-yard line. Headed away. Well, can somebody get there? St. Mary's took it away and knocked it out of play. Well, of mass substitutions. Almost a brand new team coming in. I think they sent like six six players off the bench. It's nice when you get that kind of talent. You can just intersp intersperse them in and out. Halfway through and counting the second half, St. Mary's leading it one nothing off the pretty goal by Thongstafong. They banged it off Lincoln Sudbury. They take it back. Trying to center it. Couldn't get the shot off. From long range, they try to shoot it, and they shot it way wide and out of play. That was Desmaris rifling that one wide. And Mary's knocks it out. Lincoln Sudbury will get the throw in. Desmaris will take it. Now he's not going to take it. Because he got subbed for. He's going out. No, he's not going out. They just changed positions. Trying to throw it to the net. Everybody converging. St. Mary's got a head on it and knocked it out. Lincoln Sudbury will get a corner kick. I believe it's Lucy coming from the near side. Knocks it deep. And Lincoln Sudbury got a head on it and knocked it out. Actually, it was Ryan with that corner kick. Lincoln Sudbury controlling. Taken away by St. Mary's nicely. They knock it deep. Lincoln Sudbury heads it away. And they right back at it, taking it into the St. Mary's end. Blocked by George. St. Mary's takes it away again, knocks it right to Mike D'Agostino, the St. Mary's coach. I thought St. Mary's just knocked it out. It must have been deflected because they're giving a throw in to St. Mary's. And that one went off. 
of St. Mary's. Headed away by George. St. Mary's has it and keeps it in. Now it went out. I can Sudbury quickly gets it in. They come to the near side. We're going to get it out in front. George knocks it away. Tip back. Now they can Sudbury knocks it back to the St. Mary's end. It got knocked out by Lincoln Sudbury. And I guess they were calling a, a bump and a bang against Majuka because they gave St. Mary's a, a free kick rather than a throw in. They try to tip it, broken up. St. Mary's knocks it deep. Kevin Uyen, De Oliveira. <coughs> he took De Oliveira down, no call. Headed away by Mackey. LeBron heads it away. That was Casper again, looking for a shot from long range, blocked out in front. St. Mary's tips it away. Popped up. Pappas came out, looking for it, and now he's going to kick it out of play. He ran over one of the Lincoln Sudbury players. He went up. As he got his hands on, he, got, he ran right into a Lincoln Sudbury player. Lincoln Sudbury thought they had a goal. They threw it out in front. Matthew Ward tipped it. Pappas got a hand on it, couldn't keep it out. It deflected by Pappas, and when it went by, it hit the post and bounced out rather than in. Thongs to Fong's goal, hit the far post and bounced in. This hit the near post and bounced out. They were that close to tying it up. Great bid by Matthew Ward. Out in front, got the header. Thought he had a goal. Now they called Lincoln Sunbury for contact, free kick. Somebody touched the ball. Longstaffan will take it, but Ward thought he had a goal easily. Then it looked like Pappas took it away with a great save, and then it bounced off Pappas. It looked like it was going in. It was by him, and it hit the post and stayed out. Ward couldn't believe it. He just shook his head. He merely swung and missed. Nice little shift by Ward. Looking to center it. Knocked away. <laughs> Deflected. Off. Kevin Nguyen. Well, Lincoln Sudbury is shaking their head. They've had all kinds of opportunities. Pappas made a couple of really big saves. He got a piece of that one at least. Now he comes out, makes the play. And I think that was Lucy bearing down on him. And then a couple where they've been open. Casper had one wide open and knocked it over the net. He shook his head, couldn't believe he did. Then he missed the net. And Lincoln, somebody's going to get called for climbing the back, trying to get the header.
Lincoln Sudbury has deflected. George trying to walk in. Got upended. St. Mary's takes it back down that far side. Nice little shift, trying to throw it in front. They got it to the net. Last one was there to scoop it up, hold on, and kick it away. 10 minutes and counting left in this one. One to nothing, St. Mary's. They scored in the first half. They really haven't come close in the second half. Lincoln Sudbury certainly has. That last one by Ward. St. Mary's got a break. When it hit the post, it bounced out. St. Mary's clears it away. Lucy sends it back the other way. Knocked deep by the Spartans. Headed back by Lincoln Sudbury. Lucy pops it up to the far side. St. Mary's collects. They knock it out, and this will be a corner kick. They try to Saved the corner kick and knocked it out on the sideline, but they knocked it out off the back end line. Both teams will make substitutions. Headed away by St. Mary's. And there's another one of those kicks trying to get it to the net. Got too much of it. Hit it high and wide and way out of play. They had a lot of those. Perez will kick it away. I was trying to send it upfield. He banged it off Ward and out of play. <laughs> trying to get it to the net. They got a foot on it and deflected it wide. And now they knock it over the net again. Another shot right out in front, right at the goal line. They had Pappas where they wanted them. And they drilled it over the net. Boy, if this score stays 1-0, Lincoln somebody's going to be talking to themselves on the way home. Brian kept it in. They get by one. Now they miss connections with the pass, but they'll pick it up. And they bang it out in front. Pap has got a piece of it. Knocked it away. And it come flying in was Ryan trying to get a shot off. St. Like Mary's clears it away. St. Mary's almost like just hanging back, playing defense, trying to keep the ball out of their net. They're not getting much offense here. But Lincoln Sudbury is. Headed away. They pop it up. It's going to go wide left and out of play. It's been all Lincoln Sudbury. St. Mary's can't get the ball out of their own end, and they haven't come close to having a scoring opportunity. And Lincoln Sudbury has been buzzing all around the St. Mary's net. They just missed a, virtually a wide open net from down close. And now they're right back at it. St. Mary's knocks it deep, 
Lincoln suddenly picks it off. Ward knocking it back. Takes a big hop. Pappas started to come all the way out. He had a backtrack. That thing bounced almost over his head. And he went and got it. And he'll kick it away. High, booming kick again, way up into the lights, past midfield. Conley battling, Lincoln Sudbury takes it away. Coming back, getting around one. It got blocked. De Oliveira kicks it upfield. St. Mary's content to just sit back and play defense and try to stop Lincoln Sudbury from scoring. They kick it very deep. It bounced. Pappas grabs it, and he got run into. He's okay. He's getting up. I think that was Ward going to the net. And he ran into him, bumped him, and knocked him down. He was just going for the ball. He got there almost the same time that Pappas grabbed it. And they both, nice, nice to see, they both shook hands. So St. Mary's will kick it away. So we've got just over four minutes left. St. Mary's leading it one nothing. We're going to get a timeout down the field. Got just over four minutes left. St. Mary's holding on to that one nothing lead, and I mean holding on. They haven't been down the Lincoln Sudbury end much at all. They've been kind of laid back, saying, "Let's play defense and keep them off the board." They're not, almost like they're not even attempting to play offense. And it's right back on the St. Mary's end. <laughs> they banged it out off Lincoln Sudbury. <laughs> and they bang it off Lincoln Sudbury again. Right to the St. Mary's bench area. First time in a while that St. Mary's been down this deep. And they overthrow. It's going to go out of play, and Lincoln Sudbury will get to kick it away. Lincoln Sudbury's got to get a little giddy up in their step. The clock is now the enemy down one to nothing. George heads it away and goes out of play. St. Mary's knocks it out again. Quickly they'll throw it in. Headed away by St. Mary's. Lincoln Sudbury looking to get a kick. It got blocked. St. Mary's will knock it away. St. Mary's has just about everybody down from... To the 20 yard line in, they got one player back. And they're just content to kick it away. And they haven't even thought about offense for most of this se second half. Kevin Nguyen battling, still battling. Still trying to get it by. Latchman finally comes out and takes it away. Good individual effort by Kevin Perez. Final two minutes and counting. Lincoln Sudbury keeping it in. It's been down here most of the second half. Trying to throw it in front. 
St. Mary's clears it away. Short. Goes wide left. They've been getting a lot of shots. They've been pulling them wide left, wide right. Getting too much foot, knocking them out of play over the net. They've missed a couple of open netters. Pappas have made a couple of huge saves. And that, of course, the one where he just got a piece off Ward, deflected by him. But St. Mary's got a huge break when it hit the near post and bounced out. Ward, nice back checking. And that's Kevin Nguyen, I believe, with the nice play. De Oliveira just holding it. Run the clock, he tips it by. Just playing keep away. He finally lost it and went down, but he ran a lot of time off the clock. St. Mary's will make a substitution. That was almost like, I'll hold on to it and let the clock run out. Like, like a freeze in basketball. St. Mary's has it where they want it. Down at the Lincoln Sudbury end. With time winding down. Leading one to nothing. And just trying to hold on to it. Here's De Oliveira again. Lincoln Sudbury can't get it. St. Mary's just running the clock. De Oliveira keeps it in. Gets right through a couple of people. They take it away. But Lincoln Sudbury's got to try and do something with it. Conley winds up with it. They went out off Lincoln Sudbury. And they blow the whistle. So St. Mary's able to run the clock out. And they're going to get a win over Lincoln Sudbury. Lincoln Sudbury is going to go to 8 and 2. St. Mary's officially in the state tournament. They go they're now 8, uh, excuse me, 9, 1 and 1. And that one rush by Thongstefong came up the right side, took the shot. Lashman got a piece of it. When he got a piece of it, it went by, it hit the far post and bounced in the net. On the other side, Ward was out in front, got a header the best chance they had, knocked it to the net. Pappas got a piece of it. It deflected off Pappas. And instead of going in when it hit the post, it bounced out when it hit the post. And that kept it one nothing. Pappas made a couple of big-time saves. Lincoln Sudbury, I told you, it's going to be a tough bus ride back. They're going to be talking to themselves. They missed a couple of open nets. They had shots that they didn't put on net. They knocked it wide left, wide right, knocked it over the net. They had a lot more opportunities than St. Mary's did. But St. Mary's got the one goal, and that was enough to get the win and put them officially in the state tournament. So, Fonks to Fonks, goal is the difference. St. Mary's wins it one to nothing over Lincoln Sudbury. We hope you enjoyed it. I'm John Hoffman saying we'll see you next time.